Good day, guys. Welcome back. We are back to Sailor second quest. <clears throat> so we already done first, um, the first dungeon. We're going to the second one right now, which is not that far away, to be honest. Um, so it's a probably a medium-sized dungeon, so it's not too big, but it's not too small. Getting there is not too difficult. Um, getting it out of the way isn't too difficult either. But after we do number two, we are going to the um the dangerous areas, and that's going to be the problem area. We we'll probably will die on. Um, also after that we can get the um next sword, which we'll probably get that before we go to that area, because that sword will help out. But yeah, we're doing all right, guys. There's nothing in here that's um we need to worry about money-wise. Now saying that. We will definitely need to make some money, so I might do some money grinding after this episode, so you guys don't have to see it and deal with the, um, yeah, you know, waiting around for it. But yeah, other than that, look at that. See, we're getting some money now. So yeah, guys, I do have a big issue with the Switch. And this is something I only noticed recently. Apparently, this does not have, this does not do... Um, they don't have this issue on the Xbox, or I don't think the PlayStation either, because it wouldn't make sense for them to do it. So if you connect a um, headphone to your, um, to your controller, it overwrites the sound, so the sound will come out from the controller instead of the console as well. With Xbox, you've got the option to change it so volume can come out both ways, so you can be able to do recordings and streams without much difficulty. But Nintendo only does it one way or the other. So the earphones are right, which means no sound will come out through the software, or Steve Labs in this case, and I won't be able to do much. So that's really a big letdown, so I have to use the uh, earphones on the computer itself, which is a real disappointment. I mean, I thought it would be something, you know, that shouldn't be too hard to implement. But this is Nintendo after all. I like Nintendo, but some of their practices and some of their decisions are so bad. And what are we killing these for? Uh, probably money or something, guys. They'll probably drop something. Three. Oh, yeah, they do. You drop money. Alright. A key. Go straight up. Um. I hate these things. Alright, we'll do this. Alright, I'm not going to kill everything, guys. If it doesn't have anything I think it will be worth it, I won't kill them. Um, for example, these guys are not going to be worth murdering because they're just not worth it. Now, guys, there is an enemy coming up. I don't believe there's anything in here that's worth it. It's hard to tell, guys, because when I did the maps, I did it with dark color, so it's not transparent, so I can't always see what's in it. I bet yes, guys, there's no boomerang in this one either. Um. Okay, there's a key in here, so I've got to kill him, I guess. Oh, he's going to be a pain in the ass. Oh, no, he's not. Got him. That was much easier than I expected. All right, um, now. Go up this way, guys. I don't think there's anything in here, so I'm not going to bother with these guys. We go straight down. Do -do -do -do. Now, guys, those walls, you just saw me go through this one. There's several of them in this whole game, so you're going to be seeing a lot of them. When I was younger, guys, it took me ages to beat this part of the game, because... I couldn't work it out. Oh, goodness. All right, so I've got the recorder, guys. It's really going to unlock a lot of things. Now we can pretty much get out of here. Uh, just hit him. I don't even know what the boss is, but I think the boss is, uh, yeah, two-headed Hydra. Now, it's not really a big boss, but for this early in the game, yeah, he's going to be a problem. Also, on our way back, guys, we'll get the key. I'm not going to fight these guys unless I really have to. I want to make sure I've got excess keys, guys, so I always be checking out for keys when I look on the maps and shit. Uh, okay, we need a bomb, I guess. 
I'm glad the bombs don't hurt you in this one, unlike in Link of the Past and all the other cells, I believe they do hurt you, but not in this one. Alright, so we're going to go downwards, guys. Um, there's a few options here. You can do it in this room, which is probably the... Oh, no, not this room. Oh, damn, we could have went out the other way. God damn it. Now, we've got the recorder, guys. The next one is just the boomerang, and then... I think the one after that is actually the wrath. I'm just trying to remember what number five gives you. I know number six gives you the, um... The step ladder, which is a pain in the ass to get, by the way. That's why I'm not doing it anytime soon. Alright, we'll go this way, guys. Yep, this way is probably the best way. Because apparently there's a key in this room. Now, the only enemy in here that's really going to give me any real difficulty is the same one that always gives me the difficulty. These bad bo boys, because they hurt. They're pretty predictable, but they do take a lot of hits to do. I mean, I'm surprised it keeps going up and down. I'm surprised it hasn't tried moving. There it goes. Ah, got him! Now, if I get too hit in this one, guys, the boss could be a challenge. Alright, I can't use bombs. The only thing that really kills in one hit is, um... Ah, oh, guys, that really annoyed me. I hate getting keys with these enemies. Now, next room is not worth dealing with the um, enemy, so we can just go straight to the next room, which gives me another, another key. I mean, I could try to kill him, but there's a good chance I'll get hit more and I'll kill them, so... No, what's this? Come here! Alright, here we go. Got some keys, guys. The next room gives me keys as well. This guy does not want to die. Um, this guy is going to die in one hit. All right, there we go. There you go. It's got to be a little cowardly. Early on, it is it possible I'll die. Um, when I explode like that, it's more than likely. I'm not doing very well in that department. Now, next room, I could beat all these guys to get a ruby, but I'm not wasting my time on that because rubies aren't that important to me. I can get them through other means, like secrets, which we could probably do soon enough. Actually, we should be able to get them all now. Alright, so the next room is the one that's going to give us a hard time, guys. Because it is the two-headed Hydra. And I wish I would stop going over there. Alright. So we've got two hearts and... Yeah, this could be a challenge, guys. I mean, not super hard, but they are difficult. Ow. Apparently, okay. Get lost. I can't believe I walked in there. I'm probably going to die in here, guys. Damn it! Oh well. I expected to die, guys. Like I said, he's a pretty hard boss to beat. Especially when you're early on, and especially when you didn't have a lot of hearts. Now, I've got more hearts now, so... We'll just go straight to him and kick his ass. I don't need to muck around, guys. We don't need to piss fight around. Trying to collect anything or anything like that, we can just go straight to him. And of course, there's enemies everywhere. Everywhere I need to go, there's an enemy. Isn't it surprising? It's not surprising to me at all, guys, that there's enemies where I want to go. As you can see, it only takes a few minutes to get to where we got to go. Um, now, these guys on the other hand could kill or get hurt, or could get hurt so we've got to be a little careful. I hate 
hate how sometimes you hit him and they go through the blocks. Alright, other than that, guys, yeah, we're pretty much there now. So, we can be a little bit more sloppy. But I'm gonna have to make sure I get the boss good, guys. Worst case scenario, I'll have to get a potion or something. I mean, like I said, we've already got the um, recorder, so I can easily get some hearts and just come back and beat the crap out of him. That oh, was my part, I walked into him, and I've done. Let's be a little careful, guys. Don't go too close to him. Oh, will you get lost? Oh, right, now he's following me around. There we go, guys. Once you get on the groove, just clobber him with a few sword hits. Alright, I said it was going to be a bit harder, but I died once, so sue me. Alright, so what we got to do now, guys, is go to a few areas. So, stage 2 collecting starts now. And the first place I want to go to, guys, is get my sword. We've already got the shield, we've already got a blue ring. We're pretty prepared. Um, nothing else really else to do, guys. I mean, yeah, so we're gonna go all the way back to where uh, number f So we're gonna go all the way around what there was in the original game guys in the original quest. It's in the same spot So the only place there's a few places that are, are in the same spots But for the most part they're all in different areas as you probably already noticed with the dungeon too um, Things like this piece of heart around this cart around here. It's not there no more. Also, we can start collecting some um, rubies. So uh, let's make sure that we don't miss any on our way up there. Uh, I've got a few good things out of that. Of course, I'll get hit by one of them. But I got my health back, so. So, first things first, guys, we get our um, sword. It's ironic, guys. So the white sword and the magical sword are real close to each other, like we are talking about by square by square. The uh, magical swords are like one square to the left. I'm not sure what's going on with the colour. The sword's not green, it's like a bluish colour. Might be because of my um, armour. But I don't remember um, swords changing when your armour does, so... Alright guys, we've got one enemy up here who could be a pain in the ass. It's not that dangerous because we're pretty health. And he's avoiding me, so... Alright guys, we've got the next sword up. Man, that's the first time I've ever seen him on this side. Now... We're gonna go to the desert, guys, so we can get the um, hearts container, and then we can head to the um, the death, death mountain, um, the dangerous area, which is technically death mountain. So it means I've got to go all the way around because I don't have the um, the step ladder, so I can't go straight across the river. So I've got to go all the way around just to get back up that direction. It's such a letdown. But no big deal, guys. We'll get there. We'll get there. Um, so we'll get a few things here guys. One, there is... There we go guys, a dungeon for us. I don't know if that stays here or if it disappears. I think it disappears. Yep, they disappear. Okay, it's no point doing it then. I thought that would stay there so I don't have to do it again. Alright, yes, one, guys. Take anyone you want. I want the freaking heart, guys. We can buy the potions anytime we want, but not the hearts. Alright, so... Yeah, so the next video, guys, we will start by from three and four, three and four hopefully. The money. Not much, guys, but rubies are rubies to me. 
Finally, we can start doing some damage, guys. So, ironic, guys. Level um, Dungeon 6 is not as long as the quest, the first quest, level 6. It's only 7 and 8 that are really long, and if you're don't, not sure how to do them, you're gonna, you're gonna get lost, trust me. I did a lot of the time. If there's any ones you need maps for, it'll be those two. Alright, we're heading back to the um, Lost Woods, guys. The Lost Woods is the same um, direction. You don't change that at all. I'm about halfway there now, guys. We don't really need to battle anyone. We've got a good amount of rubies. I'm going to do some gro um, level um, ruby griming. Between... What the hell? Guys, I've got no control of my controller. I don't know what happened there, guys. I lost control of the controller. It just started flashing and... That looks very weird. Maybe the, the port might have got a bit dislodged. That was weird. Never had that before. Now, I'm not using the nunchucks or the Joy-Cons. I don't like the Joy-Cons off the console itself. Well, where are we anyway? Any money? No. Wait, 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 wait. There's money. Very close, guys. There's some serious ruby. If I can get up there. No, it's not getting hit by... Freaking out, he's really pissing me off. Alright, here we go. You know what I said? I probably need to do some grinding, guys, but I don't think I'll be needing to do that now. We've got a good amount of money. Um, don't know what happened there. Alright guys, we're doing good. Um, so let's keep it over there now. Um, Alright, let's do this. Whee! What the hell? Alright, let's do this. Um, $10. Hopefully I don't need to fight these guys. I really don't want to fight them. Oh yeah, guys. It's the same direction as normal. Alright, since we're here, guys, we get the heart container. Because there is a heart container here. And there's also another one further up. Now, I can't remember if it's a... What the hell? He's following me around, creeping me out. Little friggin' follow me around everywhere. All right, let's get this. Um, we got that, guys. Now there is a palace. There's a dungeon six just under us. We can probably go there. Actually, guys, you know what? Why don't we do that? We'll go in there, grab what we need, get out. We've got plenty of keys, so I don't need to muck around the key department. So what we'll do guys, we'll go up, get the heart, get the letter, and go back to dungeon 6 and get that as much out of the way as possible. Now I don't really want to do the whole dungeon just yet, I just want to get the step ladder. Step ladder will be beneficial and it's not that far in the dungeon either. Uh oh. Like I said guys, it's not very hard to beat these guys, just be careful not to move around so much. Uh, let's go guys. So first things first. Um, I said heart, right? Um, I forgot one thing. There's something very important I need to get. It's called the bracelets. Um, actually, it's not that important. I never use it really. I probably won't use it that much. Get lost! Worst thing about these guys is they when they they can't they don't give you nothing. 
I'm gonna see they keep kicking my ass because all right I said I was gonna do number six now I don't know yet I keep getting hit by everything seriously I'm getting hit by everything just like just walking oh, right now I got oh well, at least they didn't kill me I would like to get my heart I mean uh -oh. Uh -oh. I'll get Ross All right, I want to get my heart container, guys. You know what I can do? To make it a little bit easier? I want to go the right way. It's actually this way, guys. We're going to go. And it's even worse here because there's 60 enemies and the heart container's right here. All right, we got it. Alright, we've got a heart piece back, so at least we've got something out of it. Now, let's try to get my letter, guys. Now, letter one's going to be the hardest one, and because I'm already bruised severely, it's going to be the hardest one to get. So it's not very hard to get to. It's actually really just pretty much left from where we are now. I know you don't. Oh, seriously? That was the last spot I got hit, and I got hit there again. Okay, let's see if we can get some hearts out of this. Nice try, I'm not that stupid to pull for you. Ah oh well, I got hit guys. I knew I was gonna get hit sooner or later. Whoops, sorry guys, I pushed the wrong button. Alright, um Do we really need to have the um thing now? I don't know, I don't think we do really need it. Do we really need it? You know what? Fuck it, we'll just go and grab it. I mean, only halfway, so. I'd like to know why I did not get any hearts. I know the second quest gives you very little hearts. I mean, they only got like one or two fairies in the whole game at the moment, in this quest. Usually you get a few of them. Look at it, I'm getting nothing. I didn't get jack shit out of that whole campaign. You know what? I'm gonna go straight to dungeon six. So first things first, guys. Let's go up here. Now, as I said, guys, I won't be able to beat it because I believe the dungeon boss is really hard, I think. But we can, and we can do this, guys. We can get there and, um, excuse me, where it is. Damn it! Sorry, guys, if she knows. Um dun, dun, dun. Oh, okay, no, the boss I don't even know who the boss is guys. Oh no, yeah, I won't be able to beat the boss because I don't have the um the bow. I got cold though, I dropped it in the ground. So let's get to dungeon six and get the um this set ladder that will make moving around here and here to you know this area and the other area much easier. We should be able to do pretty well, assuming we don't lose too many hearts in it. Ah, oh, guys. Okay, let's go up. I believe it's up. Can't believe I died again. I think it was the second time I've died, but I kind of expected. I should have went to dungeon number six straight away. I mean, it would be so much easier. I could have went straight to the fairy. I'm just not too sure if I can do it, that's all. But we're going to go there and give it a shot, guys. We've got plenty of keys, so... Like I said, guys, I won't be able to beat it because of the, um, the boss I require an item, and I don't have the item, so... Um... All we've got to do, guys, is pretty much go straight up and turn left, and there we are, the key. Um, the only problem is there's going to be a lot of these guys. Now, they take a humongous amount of damage. 
Oh, crud. Crud. I'd rather get hit by them than get hit by the beams. I hate when that happens. They just disappear off the screen for some unknown reason. Uh, um. Get out of here. Um, go this way. This way is not as hard, but the. Ah, oh, sweet. We don't need to worry about these guys. I don't know if they're giving me a key or anything, so. I will have to beat them up. I hate this room in that lava. I can't see them. Nothing. Oh, that was a whole disappointment. Alright, guys. The next room is going to be the hard one. I think it's the room I need to kill with wizards. Nope, it's not. Good. We're running straight to it. Damn you! Lock likes and all that shit getting in the way. Um, this one. I don't even know why I did that. I could have just waited, but no, I'm impatient today. All right, let's get in my. That's it, guys. That's all we need to do for this episode. I think we'll just finish it up here. Well, actually, outside this place, and then we'll go and continue get my friggin' letter. This is going to make things nice and easy. I mean, if I had the bow, guys, I would have tried to beat the boss too, but no, I do not have that. And now there's some, there's a room I want to go and try to get. Um, there's a good chance I'm going to die in there. So luckily for me, guys, I don't care about deathless uh, runs that much. Uh, see, now I can jump around all over the place. Now this is a room that could give me the most problems because there's wizards everywhere. Um, guys, I've lost my sword. I have to go back in there and get my sword back. Great. Uh, let's see if I can get it in a good area. No. Nope. Hopefully the bubbles will move to a better area. Because they always randomize, so... Right, I have to run all the way over there just to get myself. Damn it. The sword came back. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I thought I was going to die. Oh, I thought it would have been easier. To, uh, that's the room I hate. So I put blocks all over the place. I wonder why I had trouble in there. Oh, well. And I still don't have my friggin' sword. Oh, well, no big deal. Um, yeah, I think we'll end it here, guys. We'll probably continue it straight away, though.